Thank you. <laughs> so I just want to start with a few thank yous. Um, first thank you um, would have to be for Gareth, who is the manager of Waterstones in Cardiff, who's been fabulous and the um, my book has been named um, and launched well, and for all the Waterstones book of the month for August, which is fabulous, which is, has, has generated so much publicity and it's meant that um, I've, I've got other book signings and things coming up in um, another three at least Waterstones in Wales, maybe more. Um, so that's very exciting. Of course, um, I have to thank Alice, who is fabulous, and um, anybody who does click through the book um, will notice on the first page, um, slightly, so a dedication to Alice, and I'll just leave that out, because that's my thank you. <laughs> um, this book is dedicated to Alice and Henry Amy. Alice for being there even when I wasn't, for not giving up on me even when I did, telling me the book was worth it, and for allowing me this big romantic gesture. So much out there, and I can get quoted. And it's actually um, studied for the MA, and I would want to read yourself. So, um, if, if I, for instance, if I think, oh, I really, really want to write, really, really want to read this type of book, but I can't find it, I can't find a book like that anywhere, um, well, then I should write it. Um, and that's, that's what I started out doing. With, I, I've been writing since I was a teenager, I've been writing, and I've been trying to get published. With, all along, all the things that I've been writing, I've been having um, half an eye on the audience, um, whether it will be published, whether it's, you know, whether it's marked for, whether it's the kind of thing that will be sold in bookshops. Um, and it's kind of, it's kind of been like an internal sensor, and it kind of um, restricts you then. And I think that sometimes some of the things that you write when you're in that kind of frame of mind um, come out as a bit false. And when you, when you finally abandon the idea that you're ever going to get published and think, I, don't, I really don't care, I'm going to write this book because I want to write it and because it's a book I would want to read and it's a book I would want to give to Alice and say, this is my book, read it. Um, and that's, that's the sort of standpoint that I came from in writing, writing this book. And lo and behold, the world changes 10, 20 years down the line. Maybe even five years ago, this book wouldn't have been published. And the picture to old picture and controversial so, um, it's to the theme that I'm going to read is actually a, a little bit racy, but I have um, I have a mechanism. But what I'm going to um, what I'm going to do when I get to bits that uh, are probably not not to be read out loud in, in company, um, I'm going to do the blankety blank. So if you hear me say blankety blank, you know that there's swearing or some kind of <laughs> reference um, Okay, so I'm going to read from the beginning of the book. The actual opening is a, um, a few paragraphs new paper article and get to a scene where she's actually, Jackie, who is 18, has um, picked up a, uh, a woman who is an older woman, who never really says what her name is or um, how old she is, um, who was in the club who is what might be described, what people describe as bi-curious, if anyone knows what that means. Um, so, have you always been a lesbian? The woman asked carelessly. Jack stiffened. She takes him pick. But the knowledge that she hasn't felt flesh against flesh for some time helps him shrug enough her belligerence. She doesn't have to like the woman to black to blank her. Just as long as I can remember, she growled. <laughs> I just wondered, you know, I've always wondered what it's like to be a lesbian. She's turned away and the woman can't see her face. Of the myriad terse replies she could have given, Jackie chooses a mild one. Oh yeah? She faces the flighty bird. Well, let's just see if you can take it, babe. Leading her by the hand out of the deserted bar, she says, I've got a room up, just up from here. Jack stumbles into the after club crowd in the street. Each club has its own clean town who sit together in small crowds around a communal courtyard created by the focal point of the burger van. Alright, so, yeah, um, the MA in writing was a three-year course. Um, and when I started it, it started, it started in 2002. It took me a few months to actually work out what, what I wanted to write. Um, I think the first time I put pen to paper probably was back in 2003. And then I finished it just a week before the deadline. <laughs> um, 
um, which was in 2005. So the first draft then takes it, which is over two years to write. But then after that, I edited it quite extensively. And then once Legend actually told me that they, they wanted to print it, I went back and edited it again. So I counted when I when I say it was six years. But that's finally okay. It's just done here. Yeah. Yeah. Hello, here I am with my wine. I'm at home. We're having a party, and it's the end of the book launch. And that's, that's it. <laughs>